Okay, so I haven't done like an actual tutorial in so long and right now I want to go to the mall so I'm going to beautify myself. Now I'm just going to show you guys how I do my blush because um, I mean I do, I do it like everybody else, you know, but hey, we use different colors. I mean the only reason why I do my blush and bronzer the same way, it's because, I mean come on, bronzer is bronzer, alright? It's gonna make your face look dirty. I don't use a lot of blush because I'm trying to enjoy the roundness of my face. I wish I could have, you know, like that, but who wants to look like that? Mainly I'll use my Clinique bronzer. This is the number two Sunkiss bronzer and it looks like this and I like it because it's way darker than my face. Now, don't forget to use a bronzer that's way darker than your face. Not like, don't go like poo brown. Um, my favorite blush brush is this one. Um, I use this for contouring my face. I don't know where I got this one. Hmm. Well, uh, I don't know. So with my bronzer, I just like to swirl it just like so. Tapity tap tap. And then I, some people make a fishy face, you know, that's if you're a newbie. Punch yourself in the face and you'll see where it hurts most and that's usually below the cheekbone. <laughs> so I just apply my bronzer underneath of my cheekbones. Um, I don't do it to the point where I look really chiseled down. Okay, girl, you are not Dr. 90210. If you want to look slim, go for it. But I, I don't do bronzer to look slim. I just do it to, like, shape my face. You know, I have a very round face. I don't know if you can tell. Um, I have a very round face. I got it from my daddy. But hey, he likes it. I don't see him wearing a bronzer yet, actually. So let me get you in my face. So here's where I start. I start right here and I just bring it down like that. And I just kind of blend it in. Uh, and then you do it on the other side, just like so. And you just kind of blend it inside your temples. Just like that. Now, if you really want to look like you got your face stuck in a vacuum, you know, go for the whole charade. Do it under your neck, even do it on your temples right here, and then you can do it on the side of your nose, but I don't really do that. You just gotta embrace the natural puffiness. Pluffy. <laughs> I meant to say puffy. Sometimes I'll use my Rockin' Republic, and this one is called Shameless, and bronzer is bronzer, you know? Or sometimes I'll use my Getaway Bronze. This is MAC. Alright, so now moving on to the blush, and I always switch up my blush every time, but um, the blush I'm going to be using today is from my Coastal Sense um, 10 color blush palettes. Um, I like this blush palette because it comes with everything. Alright, this is like the blush buffet right here. Just like my blush, I like to switch up my brush every once in a while. Not really, you know. Um, okay, I like to use this color right here because it, it, it seems very peachy-ish, bronzy-ish. I, I am the worst person to describe colors. If somebody were to ask me to describe the color of an avocado, oh girl, I'd say it is the color of when you've been eating too much bean and cheese burrito, girl. I'm going to go with this peachy color right here. And I just, uh, 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 um, hello. one, two, three, four, that's it. You know, if you want to go extra crusty the clown-ish, then, you know, go for it. But hey, sometimes when I don't put on bronzer, I'll just slenderize my cheekbones with blush because you can do that too. So I put this at the bottom of my cheekbones right here because it contours your face a little bit and then I just blend it up like that. Always blend your blush, girl. You don't want your man to think he's dating Mimi. So, hey, blend it out. So, I'm going to do that to the other side. And sometimes I'll put on highlight just to accentuate what I've contoured on my face. But, you know, it's optional. You don't have to do it. Because I have really, really tan skin. And, you know, sometimes when I got too much highlight on, it's like Tinkerbell attacked me. One of my favorite highlighters I like to use is my Tom Ford by Estee Lauder from the Tom Ford Collection. And this is what it looks like, and it comes with a brush, but I don't really like to use that brush. So I like to use my Sigma, and this is the Sigma F40. The top of my cheekbones is from where my temple starts, and right here. And I just like to swipe it a couple of times, just like that. A little bit on my nose, my chin, on my gaping forehead. I repeat the process again. So that is how I do my blush and my bronzer. I hope you guys kind of learned something how I did it. But um, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!